Hey ho, quick info before the video starts. Um, as you can see, I'm currently using my green screen and it's okay-ish with flickering. But as soon as I turn my stream, my, um, my stream, my chair that way, it already starts disappearing and then it comes back. And therefore you will see a lot of flickers in the video. I'm sorry about that. I still don't have a real green screen. I would like to have one, but they're super expensive. So um, I'm currently using this. The funny thing about it is that I can do things like that <laughs> but yeah it's it's somewhat flickery in the video i'm sorry about that uh i would try to have the best position i'm also correcting it somewhere in the video but i still haven't found the best uh pose to actually make it work properly maybe it's me maybe it's my chair um but i don't know i'm trying to fix that i hope you still enjoy the video Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video on my channel. Today we're gonna do another little update video, but this time it's not like a full update, it's not gonna replace the current update, but it's a side event added to the current update. So the current update about the waves, about the Vengeful Paladin and Icy Magna, it will be together with this one. This one will be added directly into the event, it will be just a side thing so we can push additional content, release some more Digimon without it replacing the current event so you can still get the Paladin. So what is part of this update? So first of all we get two new Digimon which I want to show you today. So number one we would have a Plesiomon and therefore we're going to do this. But let me also unequip my GM suit and then all this stuff so we can actually see the stats. This should be the stats right now, right? Uh, da -da 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 -da. This looks more or less legit. Yeah, right. Okay, so we have Plesiomon, which is on the S plus rank. It's burst mode and 140-40% of stats more or less look like this. Of course, depending on your gear. But we also have... Uh, da -da 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 -da. We, offer, we also have Aegisdramon, which is double S, also burst mode. So we have a burst mode into a burst mode? I don't know. Anyways... Um, we now have some stats here as well. I guess you're more interested in the stats of this one. So we have about 40k HP if I'm not boosting my HP with something else. But that seems more or less normal. I'm just surprised where we get all this HP from. Oh, from here, I guess. Yeah, right. So this is kind of boosted by the gear. Let me let me show you the gear anyways because someone asked in the last um, video what gear I'm wearing. So on the test server, I'm using the Futuristic Battle Suit, which you can get in dads from dailies from doing... Um, dungeons that I'm also wearing Biomon Flawless Gloves, Satan Shoes, uh, no suit currently, but I would usually wear the Snowboard Suit, which gives you 700 attack. Then together with that we have Fanglongmon Earrings, Necklace, Bracelet, and also Rings, a normal Digital Aura and a Purple Vice, together with an XAI version 6, and just a normal Shocker Ship, no chips uh, attached. So right now we have 40k HP roundabout. This is actually pretty much it's really really tanky. I can't believe that this is actually like is this the real let me double check. Okay, I double checked. I really can't find anything that's wrong. So I really hope that those are that those are the correct stats. So the base HP would be 13,742. It's it's really really tanky. We have a base DS of 3,795 and uh, 97 leading to 5,485. Total, we have a base AT of 3,600 and a total of 15,300. And we got a base AS of, uh, I'd say, 1.8, 1.7. Let me unequip the, oops, let me unequip the uh, deck buff. Yeah, the base AS would be 1.8. Okay, that's that's actually a decent Digimon. Together with that, uh, together with that, we also have Crit of 197, okay, that's a bit low compared to some others. A hit rate of 5,200, a defense of 2,500, and block is 87. As always, 202 evasion. Yeah, that's the Digimon so far. And together with that, you have a pretty decent Digimon, but there's also something else. There's something behind me. It's an event dungeon where you also can get the Deep Savers title, if I remember correctly. Either you get it from there or from a daily quest. I, I don't remember correctly, but... but a deep saver title exists and it boosts the attribute damage of DS Digimon. So for this line entirely, plus 200 attack and plus 1000 HP. And if I get it right, this title will be nerfed. It will be nerfed after the event, so use it as it's strong, as long as it's strong. And there's an event dungeon which is giving you 10 keys per day. And on this event dungeon, you have three difficulties, two are for normal 
uh, for normal solo parties, just with one player, as you can see here. Both of them are for one players, and the heart is for four players. I'm gonna show you the HP of all the bosses in there on all difficulties, and you get a check that easy takes one key, normal takes two keys, and hard takes two keys as well. Then there are boxes in here. Air yeah, Plesiomon Dungeon Box Easy, which has OCS, NCS, Red Light, Blue Light, uh, Random Chipset Box R9 and R10, same as Reinforced Digiclone Boxes, same here, same rewards, but we have R10 and R11 in Reinforced Digiclone Boxes and Heart has actually the same rewards, I don't know what is different on them, maybe different odds. But it's R10, R11, and random D uh, reinforced Digiclone boxes. So what you're supposed to get in there as well, if I remember that correctly, is the evolutions. Like you're supposed to drop them from the bosses. Might be wrong after all, but I can't see them there, so I'm uh, kind of confused. Maybe I can try to also uh, drop them. So I, uh, I'm sure. But yeah, I would say let's take some of the tickets and go in there. Okay, so to handle confusion, I am currently wearing the GM suit again, and I also... I hope it wasn't too annoying so far, but I'm gonna move myself right here, so it's not flickering too much. I'm wearing the GM suit again, same as the uh, chipset, so I can just burst down these bosses in a couple seconds to show you uh, how much HP they have, and maybe what they drop, we will see. So, that's quite easy. You've seen it already has a million HP on easy. Exactly 1.5. Then we have Eggestromon, which is the second boss. We have two bosses per dungeon. And yeah, like I said, I don't know if they're supposed to drop something. Um, besides uh, those boxes. And I also don't know where you get those boxes. Maybe you get them in the event storage, but we're gonna find out. Uh, at least I haven't gotten anything if I got that right. Also, by the way, these are the evolution items for... Um, Plesiomon and for Eggestromon, these are the things, uh, but I don't know where you get those boxes, probably in the event storage, so I'm gonna open my event storage and see, yeah, this is actually what you got, this is easy, this is not, okay, normal was from the day before, this is easy, okay, that's what you get, that's the easy box, then we're gonna go into normal to show you the HP, by the way, uh, as you have seen, 1.5 to 4.5, so Eggestromon on easy has actually 3 million HP. So, the next one, we're gonna reset properly so you can actually see the numbers. We're also gonna make ourselves a little bit faster so we don't take years. Plesiomon on normal has 5 million HP. Eggestromon on normal has a bit more, as you can see. It should have around 10. It does have 10, okay. So also, I hope that these numbers stay like they are, because uh, Shota wanted to change something. I don't know exactly what he wanted to change, but he recently published another test patch and already announced um, the server to, or the update to go live tomorrow or also today when you see this. I actually don't know when it's gonna, when it's gonna launch. Let me double check that. Uh, it should be under announcements. Do -do 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 -do. Announcements. Yeah, okay. Um... 1 p.m. Okay, that's probably where I'm gonna uh, when I'm gonna um, release the video. Okay, here's the normal box. So yeah, I really hope that it's gonna stay like that. You've also seen that I didn't take any damage, so they're not as strong right now. They are just really tanky. Maybe those will do some damage. We'll see. On hard, we're gonna go in and check um, how long or not how long we talk about how much HP they have. Yeah. We're gonna go on fast again. Oh, I'm already taking damage. You can see that. I'm also fully cloned. Yeah, so they have a really high hit rate. At least we're taking damage now. And what you can see here, of course, we're gonna do that with four people. But four people are also not gonna be much faster than me with those cheating tools. Okay, 30 million HP on Plesiomon and Egestromon, which meanwhile is pretty, pretty big, has a lot more. It really has a lot more. You can already see it rising up. And I really hope that they actually drop those things. I would do it a couple more times to actually ensure that any of them is dropping something. Because if not, I actually don't know how you get that one. I thought that you get it from them. Okay, last 5%. We are up to 17 million. So it has 17 million HP. 
pee and I'm the most reliable tamer, that's great. As you can see, I also almost died because I didn't pay attention to my HP. But yeah, that's actually what it is. This is the side dungeon, as I said, 10 tickets per day. So for example, 10 times, uh, 5 times hard per day or 10 times easy. So, and then we can check again. We got a hard box. There we go. Now we have an easy, a normal, and a hard box. Those are all container items. What did this one include? Blue light of digital. Okay, the normal one got number change stone times three. And wow, the hard one got option change stone times uh, five. That's interesting. That's that's actually pretty interesting. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna double check how to actually get them. Maybe I can find that out real quick. Okay, I have actually no idea how you get that item. <laughs> I mean, meanwhile, I found out that it is in the shop. You can buy it there. You can get the evolution item, actually both, for almost 300 crown. Oh boy. Um, and it also comes with a ride mode. This is what I forgot to mention about the new two Digimon. And I also opened some of the boxes, got a decent amount of OCS and NCS and reinforced Digiclone boxes, so I'm kind of happy about um, how this box turned out to be. Uh, but I still don't know how to how to uh, actually get that. I'm pretty sure that it will be mentioned in um, that it will be mentioned in the patch notes as how you get them. But at least right now, I sadly can't tell you any more about that. The only thing I can do is to evolve into them and show you the right mode as well. So you have seen the dungeon, the Digimon, and all that. Uh, I was also thinking if I should actually showcase Eggstromon now that it's double S. I think it was weaker when we showcased it uh, on stream. Um, but it's data. It's data. So the only real thing I could do with it is RKD, and for that, it's definitely too weak to solo it. And uh, ZDG, and who the fuck does ZDG nowadays? So, yeah, I just decided to go with this, doing this little showing you the Digimon and also showing you the dungeon, and yeah, that will be it. I hope you're fine with this little update. Of course, it's not as impressive as the one about Paladin Mode, Vengeful, and uh, Icy, which is actually the same line, which you can still get on the server by just farming those ways, which is a lot of cancer. We actually got it live on stream after about 800 bucks. We had really bad RNG there. Um, so I hope that you have a more pleasant experience with that event, but we got it after all. Doesn't make it better for me, but we got it after all. Sadly, on the test server, when we tested it the first time, we opened 100 boxes and got a Vengeful Ring. We opened another 100 boxes and got two Chaos German X. Great raid for RNG boxes, for free-to-play RNG boxes, but somehow RNG God wasn't uh, in the mood to give me something, so I didn't get it in lower than 800 boxes. Anyway, that's it. I hope you have a wonderful day and hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.